pulling up progression one. This exercise trains your baby's sensory and motor skills as well as coordination and balance, whilst also strengthening your baby's tummy and back muscles. Your baby's cot is the perfect place to carry out this exercise, as they can use the cot edge to help pull them up. Place your baby in their cot, close to the cot's side. Most babies will naturally try to pull themselves up into a standing position. If your baby is unsure of what to do, place their hands onto the edge and help them to pull up. After a few goes, baby will be sure to try for themselves. A good indication that they find this exercise easy and are content is they will begin to bounce whilst holding onto the edge of the cot. Pulling up, progression two. This exercise trains your baby's sensory and motor skills as well as coordination and balance, whilst also strengthening your baby's tummy and back muscles. Laying down, place your baby by your stomach so that they can use you as a tool to pull themselves up. Put one of their favourite toys on the opposite side. This will help to motivate them to pull up. Show them their toy, but do not give it to them straight away. Let them climb up and try to take it. They may become so transfixed with the toy that they forget to hold on to you for support. This is a good thing, as they will get the feeling of standing unaided. Just remember to put a hand behind their back as support, so that they do not fall backwards. Standing, progression one. This exercise trains your baby's sensory and motor skills as well as coordination, whilst also strengthening your baby's tummy and back muscles. It is the first step towards your baby standing unaided. It is a good idea to have a soft surface under your baby, such as a blanket or duvet. Start your baby in a sitting position, take hold of their hands and help them to rise up onto their legs. After they have stood up for about 10 seconds, sit them back down again and repeat the exercise. Remember to talk encouragingly throughout the exercise. Standing, progression two. This exercise trains your baby's sensory and motor skills and balance, whilst also strengthening your baby's tummy and back muscles. Baby starts in a standing position with you holding onto both of their hands. When you think they have their balance, let go of one of their hands. If you think they begin to wobble, take hold of their hand again and help them to find their balance again. Once they have found their balance, let go of one hand. Remember to alternate between the hands so that they try balancing on both sides and talk encouragingly throughout. Obstacle course. This fun game allows your baby to explore and helps train their crawling abilities and sensory and motor skills. Bobble's soft play has been used in this exercise, but you can also use chairs and small tables. The aim of the game is fun. Allow your baby at their own pace to explore the obstacles and crawl under them and lift up on them. To encourage your baby to go around the obstacle course, you can take one of their favourite toys and position it a short distance in front of them. This should motivate them to move forwards.
if they fall flat onto their stomach, give them a few seconds to try and get up on all fours again by themselves. Remember, this is a game, so enjoy playing with your baby and talk encouragingly throughout the exercise. Walking using a towel for support. This exercise trains your baby's coordination and allows them to experience how to walk without weight bearing. Take a small hand towel and fold it over a few times. Take the towel and place it around your baby's chest. Place a favourite toy a short distance away to motivate your baby to try to walk forwards. As they begin to walk forwards, you take their weight through the towel. This is a really good exercise to use when your baby is at the beginning phase of walking. Walking to mummy or daddy. This exercise trains your baby's coordination and balance, as well as allowing your baby to support their own body weight. Sit down with your legs slightly bent. Place your baby in a standing position between your legs, close to your feet. Let go of your baby and encourage them to come to you. They may be a bit wobbly on their feet the first few times, and they may fall. This is okay as falling helps them to learn what they did wrong, and you are close enough to be able to reassure them. A good way to encourage them to come to you is to open your arms out to them and talk encouragingly. Walking, holding hands. This exercise trains your baby's motor and sensory skills as well as coordination and balance. This exercise is designed towards babies that have started to take small steps unassisted. Place one of their favourite toys on the floor a short distance away from you. Taking hold of one of their hands, start walking towards the toy together. When they get to the toy, stop and allow them to bend down and pick it up. If they drop the toy, continue walking around. This exercise is a really good motivator for them to take more than a few steps on their own as it strengthens their balance and inner core muscles.